message, Renee Gonzalez, do you have for the American people and for the American uh, government, uh, particularly President Obama? I would start with the American people. I believe, I mean, I, I was born there. I have family there, good people, uh, people who don't, of course, they don't have my political uh, opinions, but they supported me all the way since I was arrested. They supported my, my wife, they supported my daughters, and they are good Americans, like a lot of Americans that I met. I met good people everywhere. I met good officers in Yale, people who were uh, professional, who were decent. I met good people who was uh, in prison, but they weren't bad people. And I would say to all those people, to the American people, that uh, we have more in common that separates us, that we should live uh, together as neighbors, uh, relate to each other through the things that make us uh, human beings, to the things that unite us as people. And uh, that it's been too long uh, for the two countries to be separated by politics. As to the U.S. government, to listen to a whole continent that is telling them to change their relations with Cuba, to sit down with the Cuban government and talk about everything. The Cuban government has said that again and again, and I believe it's time for the U.S. government, for Obama, if he wants to leave a legacy, uh, as a president in the continent to sit down with Cuba, and a lot is going to change both with Cuba and with Latin America.